Hello, YouTube. Um, I was going to do a video of me tearing parts on, but I'll just try to show you something here. Well, this here here is my father's old number five record vice. It used to be... It was sitting in this purple vice, which I painted purple because I just, well, figured I might as well paint it some nice color that is unlike any other one. It was sitting in my father's business basement i don't know probably 30 years ago it was put underneath a bench in the what late 70s sat in there till almost the 80s then the building was turned into my my parents house when it burned down in 1984 and then about 10 15 years ago in the mid 90s i asked my father can i have that vice so i took the vice and then it sat on my garage floor for probably 10 years and i seen a video on how to restore vice so i decided to well did exactly what I did and I just cleaned it up and restored it. It's got a lot of abuse on it. Like it, it's been gouged out here. One of the screws is missing. It's, people always beat on this thing. This is pretty a beat up. But I didn't I didn't use uh epoxy and I didn't grind it off. I, I just left it. The jaws are original, rings original. It's a nice vice, not cracked. And then while I was on YouTube watching videos, I seen this Actually, yeah, I was watching, listening to the videos, and I decided, well, hey, let me check out uh, Facebook Marketplace. Well, I found this little bad boy, which was in horrible condition. Well, it wasn't in horrible condition. It was just painted like shit. So, it's a number two Chaz Parker, which I get some better light here. Let's see, I basically stripped it, clear painted it with clear satin finish and I have no idea where I'm going to put it in my garage but it was like 75 bucks and apparently they're really good vices and they're nice the only thing it doesn't have is a swivel base and then while digging around in my garage I didn't know I had another vice I have a little old record number two should I buy like five more? no I don't need five more vices this is a record made in England El Cheapo vice does the job it used to have cheap, really, really cheap aluminum on it, but I took it off. And then there's this milling machine vise, which I am I made a video. I'm probably going to upload it. I took it apart. It's getting a makeover. I don't know why it doesn't call apart now. Hold on. Let me see if I can get this off here. There we go. I took it all apart. I took the slide off. It doesn't do it. Took this apart. This is the part that goes inside there. Right there. There's all the pieces. I'm gonna make new jaws for it because it need, it didn't come with jaws. See? It's in pretty good shape. It's not it's not too beat. The holes are there. And I think I came with one screw for this, so I gotta not only do I gotta figure out what size jaws to use, I have to find a screw. I'll probably use a set of cap screws if I can figure out what size them. okay see I'll get a set of cap screws at the hardware store so really like, and I'll probably drill a hole in it and sink it in there which I've seen a lot of people do I bought this one because I can't put these three on that machine right there that's my milling machine well she has the little holes here and the little hole here so I can bolt it down to my milling machine the reason why I need to bolt down the milling machine because after I clean this vise, I'm going to take this and mill it down on that machine. So I won't show you too much of the mess over there. But I, I'm going to do a video of me probably grinding the hell out of this. Or I'll skip the grinding and just show you what it looks like after. I'm not sure. I don't know if I want to make videos that are like spend 20 minutes watching somebody grind something. And I don't like the high speed dubbing videos. I don't know. They just drive me nuts. It's like, I, I like to hear people talk and tell stories and, I mean, like the human touch. That's just what I like to do. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It probably has, what, three subscribers now? Thank you.